Welcome back. I'm Coach Rose, and today let's talk about what to look for when you get your opponent on the ropes. Now, in the amateurs, it's not an advantage to be on the ropes. Uh, it's different than the pros. The pros, you might be using the ropes to tire your opponent out for six or seven rounds on down the fight, and then you make a comeback. Well, you don't have that much time in the amateurs. You got to get a lot of work done in a short period of time. So. You don't want to be on the ropes. So what do you look for? Well, one of the first things you'll see when a guy lands on the ropes, you'll see this or you'll see this. So you want to think up and down, head, body, head, body, but mostly body work, especially if you have a guy who's willing to do this. The body is open, you work the body, the head comes forward and the hands come down and now the head is open. Now if your opponent is in this position, then you're going to have to work a little bit harder to find some openings. So what you're looking for is where are his elbows? Are they tucked in tight? Well, then you're going to be stepping over and working that hook to the body and then maybe even back to the head. But think body when you're in there. Now, if he has his elbows more out here in this position, then you're going to come up the middle with an uppercut, a body shot, and maybe a left hook. So in the amateurs, this is where you want your opponent, on the ropes. So you want to get in there and you want to create some angles, change your position, do whatever you have to do to find some openings. So you don't want to fight recklessly. You want to look and think about what's there. What's there for me? And, the, and the, the more you fight, the more experience you get, the more relaxed you'll be in the ring and you'll look for these type of things. So hit the mirror first, work on your angles, then head over to the heavy bag, start throwing with some power, throw some combinations, and then you'll be ready to get into the ring and practice with your sparring partner. Train hard, and I'll see you next time.